What is Lady Fest all about? Lady Fest was sort of this idea that I had to um, try to encourage uh, girls to, like punk rock girls, to be, I don't know, building community again and to, um, I don't know, to put on an event that would sort of speak to our own needs and our own issues and things that are important to us and do it in a DIY sort of way that is sort of anti-corporate and um, feminist and stuff like that and I thought it would be really important because I don't feel like that's really provided to you by anyone you have to create it yourself and um, I thought I've, you know I've been to other festivals and things like that and I was like well I think we could really create something that's much more interesting than the festivals that are already being offered and especially the mainstream crap that's really sexist and really horrifying and I think it's important for all people to participate in their own um, community building and in their own entertainment and their own counterculture. You know, make it speak to what's important to them. You know. that each of you lives in a different area of the country. Is that ever cause any problems with the band? Well, it's hard. Um, yeah, Molly and Aaron both live in the San Francisco Bay Area, and I live in Washington, D.C. And uh, yeah, it's hard to practice. It's hard to get together. Whenever we do tour or record or practice or whatever, um, it's very expensive because someone has to fly. Always someone has to fly to be somewhere. And it's usually me, I usually fly to California, but you know, it makes the expenses high and the time together, even just to have meetings or make decisions or whatever, it it's, makes it harder on us. But you know, it's kind of fun too, it's cool. I'm thinking strongly about moving to California, so maybe that would make things easier.
girls who wanted to form a girl band. What advice would you like to give? Oh, it's out there. Uh, let's Thank see. You. Well, <laughs> just to kind of keep your head high and just do it. And even if people tell you you suck, which believe me, they will. Um, always think, think of it this way. There's for every bad girl band, there's a hundred bad boy bands. So <laughs> just do, you know, just do what feels real to you and what's right to you and what is, you know, your voice. And, um, you know, don't, I don't know, I guess don't fake it or whatever on stage. Just do what feels right to you and be honest and let it all hang out. And don't worry about what the guys are thinking, if you're skinny enough or like, are, is your makeup right or whatever, you know. I think it's cool. I like the girl bands where people are, the girls are just screaming, their veins are popping out of their neck, and they're just like, Bleh! you know. Um, so just like let it all hang loose <laughs> and be crazy.